our hotel uh, makes uh, a lot of uh, camps for basketball teams and basketball players here. Uh, it's a great place because uh, it's uh, six kilometers from Priene. In Priene, uh, there is a big uh, hole where, uh, where a lot of teams can train and make the camps, for example. Uh, this place is also uh, very good for basketball, uh, basketball and other sportsmen because uh, it's recreational. It's, uh, they, I think, um, feel healthy here because we are two kilometers from Birstenas, which is absolutely quiet place uh, surrounded by uh, uh, centennial uh, uh, forest pine forest and uh, by the river of Namana, so I think uh, it helps to, uh, uh, to, rec to regain your strength and, uh, and physical and uh, psychological, I guess, here, so I think the place is pretty, pretty good for, for camps like this. Uh, for the basketball players we have uh, extra, as we call it, king size beds. They are uh, absolutely longer, I think maybe more than two meters. Uh, so we are ready for them, we are always waiting for, for camps of basketball players. Uh, of course, uh, it's difficult for them to move around the hotel because in the elevators and so on they always have to... Uh, so, we, we are always, uh, always ready for them and we are um, making, for example, when we have the camps, we are making the, um, the dining for them is uh, in the... Um, in their private hall, so nobody disturbs them. Uh, the beds are also longer, so I guess uh, we are trying to make everything comfortable here for them. Uh, yes, we have we have a healthy menu, for example. We have healthy menu where there's no meat, and uh, people, uh, basketball players, can choose which menu, which uh, absolutely uh, is organized before they come to our hotel, uh, and it's usually. Uh, uh, buffet, buffet, so they can choose from fish, uh, meat, and so on. Usually, they, they choose, I, I would guess, uh, fish, rice, and so on, uh, healthier food, chicken, of course, um, pork. I guess it's not so popular for them. Uh, we have Wi Fi and we have the, um, the net for, for computers, so uh, VLANers are how it's called. So we don't have problems with Wi-Fi. Every room, every single room, have uh, Wi-Fi. So, of course, of course, when uh, sportsmen, uh, as basketball players, come to our hotel, we, we usually uh, are showing basketball uh, gameplays uh, in the cinema, for example, sometimes in the in the lobby bar. So, uh, especially to make make it more sportsmanship our hotel when when we have the guests. So. Yes, we have we have Wi-Fi. We also have the computer. If, if somebody doesn't have a phone uh, or something like that, they can check in our computer uh, the, the news or something like that. So with Wi-Fi, there is no problem. Now it's it's very good because uh, we are from Birstenas two kilometers, as I said. So we are the closest, I would say, uh, hotel and spa center to the arena where they are training. But when we will have in the Birstenas um, uh, the arena, so I guess it, it would be also no problem because two kilometers, it's, it's not far. Uh, so, as I said, we are always looking forward and the, our doors is, is always open for, for teams, for basketballs, basketball players and so on. I think it depends on the period and on, on, on what they, uh, they are coming. Of course, the camps are in the summer, so I guess uh, the more days uh, is, is more hot than, than humid as it, it's now. So. Um, I, I guess it's it's just a myth that it's a rainy, rainy, rainy place. For example, this summer we have a beautiful summer, hot summer. So, if if talking about the weather conditions, it's not not a problem because every room has a condition. If if there, there comes I don't know uh, players from from Africa, I would say, which likes hot, they can make it hot. Someone from cold places would like to make it uh, more and more cool, cold, so they can also regulate. So it's no problem. So we are, we are a four-star hotel uh, we, with a spa center, uh, with, with a great restaurant where, where anybody, sportsmen, a lot of people, anybody who wants to come here can find something to do for them. Uh, it's, you, can, you can relax, you can eat f uh, healthy food, you can eat not healthy food as you want in the restaurant. You can relax in the spa center, you can swim in the pool, you can have a massage or other procedure. And of course, we have a recreation center when you can, where you can uh, play pool, 
play table tennis, ride a bike or something like that. I even heard that uh, these tall guys from Iran, from Iran, they were driving bicycles. Just just like that. I thought it's a problem maybe for the tall guys like that, but they they I think they find it very very comfortable for them. I feel great. Um, I made a lot of friends here. Uh, loved coaching for Liotte Vazaritas. Uh, I thought we did very well for the most part, qualifying for EuroLeague, saving the season, and playing against um, Kaunas in, in the finals, and then qualifying for EuroLeague and beating Panathinaikos. That was a great, a great moment. Um, no, I really lo loved um, uh, living here. Uh, Lithuanians are wonderful people. Uh, loved coaching here, um, and uh, and it's great to be. Well, the the, the university uh, team of Lithuania uh, did a great job, and and sometimes it was hard for us because they had five shooters on the floor, and uh, for Hamed Taradi, our seven-two center, it was a little difficult. But they uh, they uh, they did a really good job, and I thought our guys, for the most part, did well. We worked really hard the last few days. Um, had a tournament in Latvia, so I think we're ready to go to Italy. Well, I think it's the old cliche, one game at a time. Uh, obviously, other teams are huge favorites to qualify for Rio, uh, the Greeks, the Croatians, and obviously, especially the Italians who have uh, a lot of NBA players, and, um, and so you have to approach it one game at a time. And, you know, sometimes miracles are possible, but you have to believe that. Um, and so, so that's my job, to get our guys to believe that they can beat anybody as long as we play the game the right way, as long as we fight and play together. So let's see what happens against uh, Greece on the fourth. Yes, absolutely. Uh, uh, Arinas um, doing a great job. And, uh, it was a great camp. It was short, only uh, only three days. I, I wish we could have stayed longer. Uh, it was so well organized. The hotel uh, was great, and obviously uh, uh, this arena here with the weight room uh, are great as well. So uh, uh, it was great for us. We couldn't be happier, and uh, you know, hopefully the results in Italy will show how good our preparation was.